And our first bitter cold temperatures of the season mean now really is the time to weatherize your home for what could be a very cold winter. Jordan Burgess working for you with ways to get ready. This early cold can already lead to some high heating bills and nothing's more of a drain on the budget than those glass doors or glass windows letting in that cold air. So we took a look at some simple ways to try to deal with this and save you money and aggravation. Their inside decorations have been pointing toward winter for weeks. Now the outside finally matches. Has winter been good for business for you guys? Absolutely. The early Arctic blast has meant a boost for stores like Handyman Ace Hardware and Kettering. A lot of salt sales, shovel sales, anything that can cover any extra air coming in. The cold has customers like Charlie Bentevegna shopping for items that can normally wait until after Thanksgiving. He was here to pick up furnace filters. Oh, I like winter. I like it. You need all four seasons, but I didn't, I didn't need it this soon. The frigid temperatures caught some off guard, but it's not too late to winterize your home. That's great for keeping a lot of the cold air out. And Things like covering windows or weather stripping the gaps around doors. Just to seal that cold outside and keep that heat inside. Keep your energy bills down and a few dollars go a long way. The other hot pick so far has been salt. At the end of August, I had a few customers coming in and was a little jumping the gun on the salt sales at that time. Many Miami Valley communities are short on salt, but you can find it in stores, although how long it lasts will depend on how severe the winter is. I would definitely say it wouldn't hurt to come in and get your salt. We've got plenty of it. And many area stores ran out of salt last winter, so that's something to keep in mind if you need to stock up. Reporting live, Jordan Burgess, 2 News, working for you.